school shopping. <laughs> it's so stressful. It sure is. And it's overwhelming. And if you have sensory issues already, it is over the top overwhelming to go back to school shopping with so many things going on in stores. And so Walmart is saying, mm, we're going to change that. We're going to make it okay for everyone. And so they've added some what they're calling sensory-friendly hours Saturday really? morning. How in the world does that even work? So they're going to turn off the lights. They're going to dim them down. They are going to stop all the moving visual things around the stores, make them still images. Um, anything that's flashing, not going to be flashing anymore. No blue light specials. Remember those with the blue lights? Going yeah, that was at the Kmart that no yeah. longer exists. Okay, but no more. No more anything that could frighten someone. And they're asking people that shop during that time to be quiet. And so it's just going to be a more quiet, calm experience. I like that. So that everyone feels comfortable going shopping. Shopping carts where the wheels don't squeak or you've got that one buggy wheel that goes back and forth. That's all going to be fixed. Well... That is that is the hope, is that <laughs> that, is that wheel one, is going to be fixed. That's what one would hope. They're going to do what they can. It's a good idea that they're doing something like this. Kind of a chilled, dimmed down, calm atmosphere, mm -hmm. which is good to the best of their ability. I'm sure there's going to be some things, but still, well, and it's there, a good idea. There may be some people who are overstimulated still, and they might cry out or make a noise. So it might not be 100% quiet, but it is going to be... Uh, the more sensory friendly time in which you can hope for a quieter atmosphere. And I can see other places starting to do something like this. So they're just kind of leading the charge. I hope so.